true. Coming soon. Hey, what is up, guys? CGTV here, or probably I'm gonna change it to Mr. Gim. I'm not sure because when I try to type my name in YouTube, CGTV doesn't appear. So I guess changing of name would be a great idea. Of course, many of them has been also asking me to, you know, change change because you can't outdo people who have like hundred thousand subscribers out there. So yeah. So today is Gaming Friday, so today I'm going to share with you guys my top secret of Chang'e from Grandmaster all the way to Mythic level. So I'm going to share with you my, my build, my purchase item and also the custom ember. With this, I believe you can do the same as me if you follow the tips and tricks. Yes, so without further ado, let me go through all my items and my amber with you guys so first up i actually use uh, the mage amber so with that amber the first row the talent will be agility followed by observation which is the magic penetration skill and the last talent will be the impure rage if you don't have like enough level or whatever you can also go with the mystery shop so let's say you purchase the item at like 90 percent so you can get items faster so if you really really don't have enough magical dust to build out your mage amber you can also use the magical amber it's not a big deal if you cannot get it so the magical talent will go to awaken flow and magic power search so next up is the spell tap. Spell tap usually can go with flicker or even the spring. These two spell is really good for Chang'e because she don't have any blink or whatever spell. That's why she needs some very quick movement sometimes because you meet heroes like Gaussians or Leomon, their speed is so fast that there's no way for her to escape so the best would be flicker sometimes it's just slow you can just bring it away so next up will be the item build so the item build is kind of simple there's a lot of ways to to build this because you can also go under the pro build to build with the pro like what's the pro using and this and that but I have my own sets or items that I always buy. It works for me. But of course, you can choose to follow the other pros. So in my case, I'm going to build it for you right now. So the usually the first item that I buy is the Lightning Truncheon. So what's good about Lightning Truncheon is that each time after 6 seconds, you do a magical damage. There will be like a chain lightning kind of effect that hits three enemy that based on your hero's maximum mana so technically it's like a chain lightning that will damage people it's good for farming also so that will usually be my first item second item will be usually the feeding time so each time you eliminate or assist in the fight the cooldown of the ultimate is immediately reduced by 35 percent so you can literally use your ulti and then for a while after that you can use it again so the rest of the item doesn't really matter which come first or whatever but of course depend on your playstyle you can go with ice queen wand so it will slow people once you hit them you also gain like 7% of movement speed which is a good item for Chang'e that could probably be the third item if you really want or the rest could be the holy crystal if you need more magical power a divine glaive if you want to hit more tanky hero so the magic penetration is one of the good thing also when the opponent is like, like high in HP usually they do more unique damage for this item calamity reaper is one of the items you could probably use glowing wand could be also a possible item concentrated energy 
it's a magical life steal item so basically you don't have to go back to town if you own this item you can just leech from anywhere so i'm going to show you now the gameplay of how you should encounter or how you should you know defend yourself this and that by the way they are all pub so now they are my friend i usually solo my game but of course if you have like teammates that are not so good uh you could still win of course if the afk or the feet like over eight times and nine times probably you're going to lose so right now i'm just going to show you the whole gameplay that i played the other time yeah just enjoy Resurrecting An soon. ally has been slain. An enemy has been slain. An enemy has been slain. An enemy has been slain! Turret has been destroyed.
Initiate retreat. Request backup. What? Where's my little bunny going? Request backup. Request backup. What, what is this place? It looks like an easy lost. Monster kill! An enemy has been slain! An ally has been slain! Hey... not so high... Don't you... Your team destroyed a turret! What... what is this place? It looks like we may be lost... Destroyed a turret. Request backup. Request backup.
Alright guys, that's the end of the video. If you have any question in mind, feel free to drop them down in the comment section below. I read all comments. I hope these tips and tricks really works well for you. And if you do like this video, please let me know with a like, subscribe if you haven't already, and I will see you in my next video. Okay, thanks, bye!